Hiya, it's uh, Andy from uh, Barnsley's Retro Clan. Uh, we're going to rename and drop um, the retro gaming stuff that whoever comes across our channel will be able to see. Um, we're going to just concentrate purely on uh, football, um, more so you know, Barnsley Football Club, do um, vlogs and stuff and uh, when football is up and running again, because at the moment it's not being played due to coronavirus, uh, we'll be able to uh, preview games and also talk about it afterwards as well. Um, but this one, uh, this first one um, on his new uh, topic, is just going to be a quick brief uh, summary on our, I think players is doing up well, how uh, they've been performing uh, this season. Uh, till football stopped. We're going to call this channel now the um, the channel that we've got at the moment is called Barnsley's Retro Clan. It's going to be named in the red corner. Um, straight away I'm going to say um, the best YouTube channel ever for Barnsley uh, is Tights TV. Um, I do videos for them as well. So, you know, it, they're the best out there. This is just something that um, I've decided to do on my own as well, just so I can do videos as and when. Um, I'm not going to do like what Tykes TV do uh, at matches because, uh, like I said, they're the best ones for doing that and uh, I do videos for them anyway, so that's fine. Um, so, yeah, there we go. Um, so, let's start see how, uh, what I think about um, how we've been doing um, at the moment. I'll go through players and I'll just give them a brief um overview I think how they've been doing. Um first of all goalkeepers Sammy Radlinger um to be honest I've been a little bit disappointed with him. Um yeah it's um difficult for any player to settle in a team let alone a foreign player coming to a different country but I don't know there's I've just been a bit disappointed with him. Um Personally, I don't think he's my first choice keeper. Whether he's going to be staying, you know, when the season uh, starts again, I don't know. But um, yeah, overall, um, I'm a bit nah about him. Um, I don't mind him starting, but I do prefer um, Brad Collins uh, over him, if I'm honest. Um, Collins, to me, would be uh, the first pick for keeper. Um, even if they're both uh, fit, I'd, I'd pick Collins any day. I think he's a better overall keeper. Seems to command his box a bit better for me. Um, and I just think he's better, you know, like reflex-wise. Uh, Radling, for me, he don't seem to like to dive or whatever. Um, so, yeah, um, those are my thoughts on um, goalkeeper. Um, Jordan Williams. Uh, I like Jordan Williams. I think he's a... A young lad that's been thrown in. Um, I think he's done well. Um, still raw. Uh, still going to make mistakes like a lot of people are in the team. Uh, but I think we've got a good player in back in there. Um, if we uh, just stick with him, regardless what division we're going to uh, end up, uh, when all this is sorted, this coronavirus and lockdown, uh, we should. Um, you know, stick with him, I think he's going to be a good player. So, yeah, I've been, I've been quite impressed with him. Yeah, he has had a few stinkers, especially that game where he couldn't even throw a ball. Do you remember? <laughs> but, uh, again, like I say, it's going, to be, it's going to be like that. But there is a player in there, and I think he's going to be a good one. Um, other Williams, Ben Williams, um, I like him. Um, I think he got injured. Um, then when he came back... Um, He's been up the bench. Um, again, I, I like Ben Williams. He gets stuck in, not afraid to go in for a tackle. Um, again, another young lad, and that's that's what they are in our team. Um, yeah, stick with him, and I think he'll be all right. Um, again, he's going to have mistakes in. He's going to have good games, he's going to have bad games. But that, that's what you get when we let a team full of a young, young lads. Kenny Dougal, not really seen much on him um, since uh, Stendhal went. 
Um, I think his drop down pecking order um, with Struber. Um, personally, I would like to see him stay, but I can see him going uh, once his contract's up. I don't think he really fits into Struber's plans. I'm hoping I'm wrong, but that's what I think uh, regarding Dougal. Bambo Diaby. Um, yeah, uh, let him send down uh, whether that allegation what were made against him is true or not I don't know but it's all gone quite over that um, to me he's like an old fashioned defender he's not the quickest but I think he's alright he, he, he has struggled in a few games um, but no, I don't know. I'm a bit, I'm a bit like that with him. But hopefully, you know, he'll stay uh, with us. Hopefully, uh, all this uh, stuff, what's going off about him, that um, failing drugs test and whatnot. I don't know. I don't want to say on that one really. Uh, Mans Anderson um, looks like he's had one assist up now. Um, there is a player in there. I think. Um, is a player that's really, really low on confidence at minute, uh, and I think that showed in his performances. Not really had somebody at side in him to um, guide him sort of away. But I mean, his first game, if I was at the beginning of the season, one the one against Fulham, um, you know, it, it did look good. But they all did on that game. Um, but yeah, I think I think there is a player in there, but I think he's just absolutely at rock bottom with his confidence and I think that's what's affected him but yeah there, there is a player there um, but we'll see uh, Jacob Brown I've got it down that is uh, two goals and eight assists at minute um, I like Jacob Brown I think he's going to be uh, a good player uh, I think other teams will be looking um, at him uh, to sign uh, he, he seems to get better and better. Um, I, I think he's a key player for us. Uh, I, I just don't think I can hold, hold on to him. Uh, really good player. Uh, Cameron McGeehan, who's gone out on loan. Um, I don't think we'll see him again. I think uh, I think his time's up at, at Barnsley. Um, so, yeah, I don't know about him. Uh, Corley Woodrow, again, other teams will be looking at, uh, looking at him. Um, definitely a good strike and when he's got service I think uh, if he had better service I think he would have even had more goals uh, this season so yeah we're going to um, do well to keep hold of him um, I've got it down at minute that he's got 14 goals and 2 assists which for you know a team at bottom at division that, that's pretty good going Mike Bearer 1 goal 3 assists um, very, very hit and miss bearer. Um, mm, um, is it championship material? I would say not at the moment. Um, again, after we've seen a season or so, if we're still in championship, you might be all right. Um, but yeah, Drew is still out on him for me. Uh, Connor Chaplin, 10 goals, 4 assists. Uh, Chaplin, I think he's hit ground running. Um, really good striker. Even if he doesn't score, he's, you know, he's put a shift in. Um, to me, all round striker, really. Um, he's small, but you can't help that. You can't help your size. Um, excellent striker. I believe that this team's already uh, looking at him. So, again, you know... Have confident his board um, to keep him. We don't know. Jack Walton now probably third choice goalkeeper. I think he personally needs to go out on loan uh, if that's still the same when um, season starts. I don't think he needs to have first team football, uh, but I like Walton. Um, Killian, I can never pronounce his name. Is it Ludwig? Ludwig. Um, who was on loan, not full back. First game for us, really, really dodgy. But again, to be expected, foreign player coming straight in. Uh, but 
Yeah, I can see why Struber's got him. I think he's going to be a good one. Um, Jordan Green is going out on loan. I don't think we'll see him again. Uh, that was strange signing anyway. Uh, Luke Thomas, one goal, four assists. Uh, I like Thomas. Um, I don't think he's better when he comes off at bench for some reason. Um, I don't know. Um, I like expecting a little bit more from him actually. Um, but, you know, Championship's a difficult uh, league. Marcel Witzmeyer, I think he's still finding his way. Uh, Struber seems to rate him. Um, again, but, you know, I think we, we just need to give him a chance. But when you hit bottom at league, um, you can't have time to gel. Or, I mean, I hit that term anyway. I think that's... Uh, uh, an excuse for a manager anyway when they use the term uh, gelling uh, team um, players to gel um, but at minute uh, I, I just think wait see best in him by a long shot um, Michael Solbo uh, defender yeah um, I like him strong I think he'll be next captain because um, I think Mowit's going to go if I'm honest I don't think we'll keep hold of Mowit but I think he's, I think he is our next captain, um, strong defender, um, Patrick Schmidt. Uh, what we got here? One goal, one assist. I know he's not gained much game time, but for a striker, that's that's poor, you know. That that's that's rubbish. That um, I'll be honest, not impressed what I've seen. Um, while we signed him, I don't know. I think it was just a panic signing. I think he was like Kiefer Moore's replacement, I think, if I remember right. And uh, Kiefer Moore and Patrick Schmidt are just, now nah, you can't even compare them. So, no, I'm not too impressed with him at the minute. Um, Callum Styles, not really seen much on him, but I like him. I think he needs at least another season out on loan, probably at a uh, lower league. Um, Civic uh, is that unknown anyway um, at Arts, but obviously, you know, with what's happening, he's not playing. But uh, when we signed him, I don't know, he's just so slow, isn't he? He's very slow, isn't he? Um, I'm not a fan, but you, I don't know. I don't know. I, I don't think he's championship material. Clark at all. Uh, I like him. Uh, I think he's a good player, fast. Uh, attacking, um, yeah, regardless again what division we're going to be in, we should keep our dream, we should uh, fetch him along, um, yeah, I like him. Pinellas, I think he's going to, um, well, yeah, he will be going, but everything's blown over with this lockdown stuff. Um, I like Pinellas, I hope he goes to a decent club, we'll probably end up... Um, back in Spain I would think or somewhere close um, but yeah uh, I don't think we'll see him no more uh, Apple Alm three goals if not more than if not more than Schmidt <laughs> uh, Apple Alm like him uh, steadily got better his first game in Cup um, I didn't go to that game to be honest but I had it it was a shocker but they weren't just in Mockfield um, but yeah, I like him. I, I, again, I think he's going to be a, a really good player. Um, Mabadou Tiam, a little bit like Pinellas. I don't think we'll see him no more. I think he'll uh, end up going. Um, but I don't think he's going to be um, the right type of player that we need to keep. I think, uh, you know, thanks for everything like, but I don't think we need him no more. Um, Mowit, love to keep him. Excellent midfielder, got better and better and better. There will be other teams um, putting bids in for him. Um, that's why I think Solbo is going to be the next captain. Um, yeah, I, I don't think we'll uh, see him no more actually. Um, but I hope I'm wrong. Um, three goals and seven assists. So, yeah, uh, excellent for um, a midfielder that's playing you know, in a struggling side. Uh, Simulez, uh one goal. Um, again, I think he needs to go out on loan to get the best out on him. 
but yeah, there is potential here. You can see, you know, it's, it's going to be quite a good player. Malik will uh, Malik will souls out on loan at Hull. Uh, one goal. I think that was against Fulham at first first game, wasn't it? No. Anyway, it's one goal. Um, when we first signed him, I thought it would be a brilliant signing. Oh, he's got problems off at field. Whether they're still there or not, I don't know. But um, I won't say that we're missing him. And yeah, there we go. Um, so overall, yeah, you know, it's you know, it's a it's a new team. Need to get uh, when we're back at it. Need to get out of this relegation. Uh, fights it's going to be tough um, I've had a lot of changes in managers as well Stendhal then what was his name Murray then obviously Struber so that didn't help matters um, but overall you know uh, I think we've got some pretty decent players there uh, some needs to go out alone or some needs to just go anyway um, but there we go so thank you for that and I hope you enjoy our uh, new channel. Uh, if you can, just leave a comment, see what you say, you know, see what you think about channel. Until next time, see you later. Bye bye.